5 Things You Should Know About Bullet Ants, The Insects That Bite The Hardest In The World One ant that may be familiar to you is Paraponera clavata, which is mentioned in the 2015 film Merrill Ant-Man. In the movie, the large black ant is referred to as a bullet ant. Ants with bullets? Why is it named that way? So let's find out by getting to know the ants, who are reputed to have the most excruciating bites of any bug in the world. 1. One of the biggest ants in the world. When it comes to ants, there's not much bigger than the black ones you typically find in your home. A bullet ant can reach a length of 3 centimeters, which is more than half the length of your little finger. It's understandable that this ant can frighten people upon sight, but what's truly terrifying about it isn't its size but rather its fabled bite. 2. Of all insects, bullet ants have the most excruciating bite. Although they sting, bullet ants don't actually bite people. Furthermore, there's a specific reason these ants are known as bullet ants. This is due to the myth that an ant sting hurts almost as much as a bullet wound. The most excruciating stings in the world are those from bullet ants, whose stings are like walking on hot coals with large nails stuck in the soles of your feet, in terms of suffering. Vicious. Even worse, bullet ant stings can cause excruciating pain that lasts up to 24 hours in addition to a few minutes. This is the reason behind the other moniker, 24-hour ants, for these ants. Fortunately, these ants do not reside in Indonesia. Instead, they are limited to Central and South America. 3. The entire colony will smell strongly if one ant starts to smell strongly. Not quite frightful enough? Verify this. Whenever a bullet ant stings, its comrades will also sting the unfortunate victim. Bullet ants will smell before they smell awful, alerting would-be invaders to stay away. Additionally, this fragrance signals to the colony to stay vigilant and prepared to sting. In addition to their ability to smell, Bullet ants will also emit sounds akin to cries to alert their companions to impending danger. You read correctly, bullet ants are capable of screaming. Thus, the answer to the question of whether ants can generate sounds is yes. 4. The Mawe tribe uses bullet ants in a horrible ritual. Given all mentioned above, it would seem that only the most insane persons would mess with bullet ants. However, it turns out that there is a tribe in South America's Amazon region that intentionally wants to be stung by bullet ants. The tribe is known as Sater Mawe, and part of their coming-of-age rite is firing bullet ants. Teenage boys from the Mawe tribe are required to gather dozens of bullet ants from the forest and place them into a sort of glove as part of this rite. The adolescent was then forced to dance for 10 minutes while wearing the gloves, which caused her great agony. And this rite is performed 20 times, not just once. The youngster has the right to be referred to as a soldier and can be regarded as an adult man after completing this ceremony. According to the Mawe tribe chief, a life without pain and struggle is a meaningless life is the lesson to be learned from the ritual itself. It seems the meaning is also quite profound. Hmm. 5. Other colonies of bullet ants are the enemies of bullet ants. Almost no other animal is brave enough to combat with bullet ants due to their extremely severe sting. It doesn't mean, however, that they are without opponents. Who opposes them? Similar bullet ants, however, from a separate colony. Whoa, isn't it like a civil war? In addition, there is another kind of fly that can live as a parasite on bullet ants. By inserting their eggs into the wound, Apocephalus paraponere flies will infect worker ants that have been damaged. Where was the source of the wound? From the outcomes of ants fighting one another. It has been established that arguing with one another is bad for you. Whoa, it seems like bullet ants are also frightening. It's acceptable to refer to it as that.
Thus, you need to exercise extra caution when dealing with these insects that have the worst stings if you ever visit the Amazon region.